everybody, it's Dr. Jazzman1 here. I got some pretty cool stuff on my gaming table that I want to show y'all. The first off is these Funko Pops that you've probably seen in my last video. So first up is this Bugs Bunny dressed up as Superman. This to me is pretty cool because you know, I've seen, I mean, there was a short on, you know, Bugs Bunny becoming Superman. And I forgot what that short was called. But um, this is pretty cool. Oh, it, it was a For Your Entertainment exclusive, as you can see on this sticker right here. Let me just... Next is this Barbie Funko Pop right here. This is a uh, Peaches and Cream version. Ain't that cool? Show you the side. And this is the back. I just collect Funko Pops. You know what I'm saying? Next up is Mr. Toad. This is the... Uh, Disneyland 65th anniversary version. As you can see, Mr. Toad's eyes are like a target. And there's some more Disneyland characters on the back. It's pretty neat. Okay guys, so I have three more right over here. Take a look at this one. This is Archie Andrews. Now, this one's pretty neat. They have the matching bow tie, the matching vest with the R on the front, and the pants, checker pants, well, no, they ain't checker pants. They look like flannel, orange flannel uh, pants, and the shoes. Now, check the side and the back. The background has all the Archie comics from the 1930s and 40s. And that's what I like about this box. It's pretty awesome. Oh, you didn't see these characters in the back, did you? Next is Classic Mickey. This is from the Walt Disney Archives. Okay guys, so the last one is Gumby. And I didn't realize that Funko had a Gumby pop final until I saw it on Amazon. I just typed it in and this is what I found. It's pretty cool. I wonder if they'll make Pokey, uh, Goo, Prickle. I think that's everybody. Yeah, I've been watching Gumby a lot of times. Okay, so here are some DVDs that I want to show you. I bought them off of Amazon and a Warner Brothers shop. Well, one from the, uh, actually two from, one of, two from Amazon, three from the Warner Brothers shop. This one I pre-ordered. It's the Orange Years, the Nickelodeon story. It basically documents on the uh, golden years of Nickelodeon, when they have the studios at Universal Florida. And it basically features all the actors, the producers, the creators, all that kind of stuff. Now, I haven't seen the movie yet, but uh, I pre-ordered it. And uh, yes, I did a reaction to the trailer. I'm going to watch this tomorrow and I uh, might give out my thoughts or do a review on it. Maybe I'll put it on my website. Kind of think of it. I haven't used my website in so long. I might post it. I might post it on my website or just do a video review on it. Or probably I'll just do both. But here's one that I also bought from Amazon. This one is Loopy De Loop. Yeah, I got that right. Um, I, I don't know if I heard of the character named Loopy De Loop. I have heard of Snacklepuss, Yogi Bear, and all that kind, all those kind of characters that I know. But um, not this guy, not Loopy De Loop. Um, it says here on the back he's a uh, French Canadian wolf to change the bad image that people have of. Wolves? Hmm. Might take a look into this. Now, I'm not sure if Pennington Bear is a Hanna-Barbera cartoon, because I mean, like, hang on. Maybe I'm wrong. It says here on the back, um, Hanna-Barbera brought Pennington to cartoon life. It was based off the book, you know, Pennington Bear by Michael Bond. I'm not sure if I had that book when I was little. Well, maybe I did, maybe I didn't. But, um, yeah. This might be a pretty good cartoon once I once I watch this. So the next one is Paws Paws. Now I haven't seen it. Now I'm not sure if I've seen this on Boomerang. But uh, yeah, I'm willing to you know look at all the cartoons. The how do you say it? Miscellaneous or I don't know how that's pronounced. But I'm look willing looking forward to looking at all these um, underrated cartoons. Maybe do some reviews on them. So yeah. This is Paul's Paul's. Last but not least 
is Pirates of Dark Water. Now this one's pretty interesting. Now I haven't seen it, but I've seen a lot of images, images of it and uh, commercials on YouTube and Google. So yeah, this one might be interesting. I wonder if you all have heard of Pirates of Dark Water. Well guys, that's pretty much about it. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if y'all did, hit that like button. If you want to see more of me, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also, you can follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. And like always, y'all keep it retro, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.